This one tends the grounds, tries to ignore what the Altma say. Their words hurt Razagad like lashes of a whip. Hello. Yes, speak and make it quick. This one is short on time. Of course she does. This one can read the skies as well as the captain, but the Nala will be staying right here. For now, at least. There are rumors of Maormer about. Anala will have none of it. This one stays in the safety of the guard until the coast is clear. What are you, a soft robes mage? Move it! Hello. souls are flatter than mine. Oh, carpentry. It's a labor of love. Unrequited, I'm afraid. What can I get you? Certainly. Woodworkers shape wood into all manner of useful tools, but bows, staves, and shields are our specialty. This work requires fine lumber and a sturdy work table. We also seek out style books and rare ingredients for more advanced work. Sure. While shaping the wood, we can choose a special trait to focus on. It takes research to discover these techniques, but it's well worth the effort. Increasing the weight or tuning the angle can draw out different advantages in the final product. Well, the piece can be improved even more through the use of resins, special elements that enhance the value and quality of your work. The improvement process is delicate, so be sure you've got enough tempers and a steady hand. Good luck! Next time I'm in the field. Welcome to our hall. Are you familiar with the guild? The Fighters Guild. You should consider joining up. We have a new guildmaster and a new singular purpose. Why don't we talk for a moment? Excellent. I know we'll all be drawing blades together soon enough. Now, what can I tell you? Right. Our new guildmaster is an Argonian, sees all colors. She has us all hunting down the danger and their damned anchors. You might have seen them. Enormous chains, plagues of Daedra boil out to lay waste to the countryside. Hard fights. Ha! Ah, there's a good question. We train our members in special techniques. And the higher-ups are always looking for motivated members to help with special projects. You never know, you might be the next Yofnir. Then let me be the first to officially welcome you as an associate of the Fighters Guild. Get out there and take the fight to the Daedra. You're in luck, comrade. Sees all colors herself is here today. Why don't you go introduce yourself? Ah, it's my comrade in arms. Welcome back to the hall. Ha! Ah, there's a good question. We train our members in special techniques, and the higher-ups are always looking for motivated members to help with special projects. You never know, you might be the next Yofnir. Guildmaster Yofnir passed away recently, very suddenly. I always thought he'd die with a blade in his hand. But he passed away in his sleep, called to sovereign guard by his ancestors. We all miss him, but Colors has proven to be a very able leader. 
No. We only draw blades in service to the Guild. We're technically neutral in the war between the three alliances. We love the Eagle Banner and Her Majesty, of course. But every race, every creed belongs under the Guild Hall's roof. Hello. Comrade, we have need of you. Will you fight by our side? The Guild has accepted an unusual contract. We've agreed to eradicate Daedric anchors when they drop from the sky. Wherever they appear, Molag Bal's minions soon follow. As we speak, two of my guardians investigate rumored anchor sites. Merrick and Aelith are the best the Guild has to offer. Meet up with them on the beach east of Volkelgard. You can proceed from there. I know you'll change the river's course, comrade. They're investigating the coastline down the beach from the Guard Lighthouse. A powerful benefactor. She hates that monsters can ruin the lives of everyday folk. Our benefactor has put gold behind her principles, and so we put our strength behind her cause. They are the tendrils of Cold Harbor, reaching into Nern. The minions of Molag Bal erect dark shrines in his honor. Landing sites for these horrors. The coin this contract brings is good, and in this time of trouble, we need a focus. Yes, I am new to my role as Guildmaster. The death of my mentor, Yafnir Iceblade, has been hard on the Guild. He was well liked among the rank and file. I hope the river has carried his soul where it wanted to go. He's a proud Red Guard warrior, one of our best and a follower of Stendar. Merrick's full title is Resolute Warhorn. He's sworn to fight the spawn of Oblivion wherever they touch Tamriel. Proof that the Guild accepts all kinds, a Khajiit. She does as much damage with her wicked tongue as with her curved blade. Taciturn, rude sometimes, but a cunning fighter. And what do you want? You're just here to gawk at the weaponry, aren't you? Make a purchase or shove off.
You're here to work metal, yeah? Check my wares before you get your hands dirty. You'll find something worth buying, I guarantee it. We put hammer to anvil to forge armor and weapons. This requires a lot of metal. We scour hills and caves looking for rare ores to work. Raw materials will only take you so far. You need style books and special ingredients for more advanced work. You bet. A true blacksmith can read the metal to determine its potential. During the forging process, we can choose a trait that best fits the item, provided we've done our research. Additional sharpening, extra weight, these are just examples. Well, the piece can be augmented even more through the use of tempers. These elements can enhance the value and quality of your work. Of course, no worthwhile endeavor comes without risk. Trying to improve an item can result in breaks, so be careful. If you're working in cloth or leather, I'm your man. What can I get you? We tan, weave, stitch, you name it. People in search of medium and light armor come to us. This requires fibers, leather, and a work table like those found in town. We also seek out style books and special ingredients for more advanced work. Yes, of course. During the tailoring process, we can choose a special trait for the work. It takes research to discover these techniques, but it's well worth the effort. Reinforced buckles, intricate detail work, each brings a special benefit. Well, the piece can be improved even more through the use of tannins. These elements can enhance the value and quality of your work. Just be cautious. You risk ruining the piece if you're not careful. Improving on perfection is no mean feat.
I watch Defiance Festival, the greatest party of the year. Hail. You are needing a good meal, yes? Everything I serve is sugar sweet and ready to eat. I brew fragrant elixirs and delicate blends. What can I get you? Could just be the spiced wine talking. Who? I don't know any Captain Fairies. And I sure don't know anything about a goat. Uh, leave me be, all four of you. Oh, the Captain. Scourge of the Sun. Destroyer of happiness and joy. Fine. I'll be on my way. Would you tell the, the girl no. is not she said she'd meet the me here. Is not <laughs> Her and Anala got into a fight. About... About Malma Scouts, yes. That was it. Rumors of Malma Scouts near the guard. And the girl went down the shore to prove Anala wrong. I'm sure she's just sitting out there with a bottle. Greetings, Milksop. You must be lost. This is where undaunted drink, not Milksops. Now go away, Milksop. This one does not want to catch your Milksopiness. Ha! <laughs> You've probably fought what? Some mud crabs and malnourished bandits? Undaunted tackled the big things. Scary things. Found only in the dark places of the world. Things with flesh-eating fists, hungry for your face. We are thrill-seeking adventurers, every one. We aren't mercenaries like the Fighters Guild, or patriots like the Dominion. We fight to prove we're the toughest of the litter. You want in? You'll have to prove yourself. That's the spirit. What's a centuries-old cursed bloodline in the face of unmitigated bravado? Enter the banished cells, stay a while, maybe bother a ghost. If you come out alive, see me at the tavern in Volkelgard. We'll talk more then. This one doesn't help. This one has already done his due diligence, seen his share of dangerous delves. His job is strictly to send the uninitiated head first into unknowable terror. But good luck in there. You'll come back with a story for sure. We are experienced adventurers. We can teach you skills and tactics a soldier cannot. Our battlefields are the deeps of Tamriel. There's also a cache of weapons and equipment found on our adventures for sale. Much more exotic than the local armory. Out by the old release tombs, you'll find the banished cells. It's just a rumor, but I've heard there's an undead king there. And he's quite a handful for those who guard him. Sounds worthy of a visit. How often do you get to see an undead king? 
We are experienced adventurers. We can teach you skills and tactics a soldier cannot. And what about Teresa, son of a brave and handsome boy? If you your animal... Hey, fresh meat. My mouth is dry. Get me a drink. Or I'll tell Talise to wring it out of you. She'll do it. She has big hands. Oh, how we mourn our good man The kind that gets me drunk. Never mind, just give me the gold, and I'll scrounge up the best swill in this place. Excellent. I'll have this gold turn to a blurry haze soon enough. You aren't half bad, fresh meat. You know how to keep the talent happy. Hey, if it isn't my favorite fresh meat. Hope you've seen more combat than I have. Taverns only hold their charm for so long. Ah, Talise and I have a storied history. They call us the twins, but I was an undaunted first. She was rather taken by my methods, effective as they are. So, she imitated me. I wasn't put off, much. Highest form of flattery and all that, right? She's bigger, slightly more buffoonish if you ask me, but I'm better. I've saved her life more times than she saved mine at any rate. Not afraid of a fight, eh? Good. We need some more honest warriors here. Faradil will tell you differently, but she takes after me. I've been quite the influence for her, and though she's been undaunted longer, I'm just a little bit better. We've been adventuring partners for years. Twins, they call us. That would be the joke, wouldn't it? I hope my friends aren't being too loud. They're friendly people, really, once you get to know them. They'd be more friendly if you weren't an undaunted. I've two leads. One is in Daggerfall territory, the other in Ebonheart Pact. Way out in Glenumbra, in the area called Hagfen, are a series of caves called Spindleclutch. I've heard tale of nasty spiders there, bigger than horses. Not even the Fighters Guild has been able to drive them away. Does a cave infested with goblins and dregs sound like a good fight? Because that's what you'll find in Fungal Grotto. It's out in Stonefalls. Rumor has it even the goblins are scared to death of the thing that crawled out from the depths there. Hey there, Milksop. Get you something? A room? Maybe a drink? Sure, friend. I've lived here all my life. What are you interested in? I have just the place. Matisson, just south of Skywatch. Sleepy little forge town with the best steel in the Old Mary Dominion. Just remember, pointy end towards the other guy. Hmm. Lot of good places for that in Oridon. I wager you'd like Esduin, though. Ancient ruin in the middle of the island. I think I heard the Artificer himself is leading a research team there. You've never heard of Tellinger? He's a national treasure. An archmage, a living connection to the past. I hear he has quite the shop set up in Skywatch. Oridon's the place for that, my friend. Just head east out of town. The beaches along the coast are some of the most beautiful and serene places you'll find in all Tamriel.
Hello. I recognize you. You were talking with Oselmo in the courtyard earlier. I heard about what happened with Estonia. Most of us aren't like that. Will you spare a moment for the true Volkel watch? This guardsman is from the village of Sasalen. They're under attack. He managed to say something about the first Oradon marines before he succumbed to his wounds. Sir, the village of Lays. With Estonia's death, we're... Well, we're a bit disorganized. Please. You handled the captain so well. Go to Sasalen, northwest of Volkelgard. Find the Conan Reeve or his daughter Elwyn, and help those people. Whatever is going on up there,
You're not with them. Quickly, get me out of here. I didn't see them until I was almost on top of them. Their ships are all along the western shore. I'm sorry. Thank you. There you are. Do not panic. Only you can see me. Come, we have to talk. Hello. 
Well, at least Tanamo is back. Good, reliable Tanamo. Oh, this should be good. What? Seasickness? The biggest swells we hit wouldn't have made my old mother queasy. And half the trip he spent in the cabin swilling that awful meat brew Bosma love. Stars above. What about Anala? Malmer? What kind of phantom fear is that? I expected better of Anala. The Malmer are no threat to Volkelgard. Well, Oriel strike me blind. I'd best be getting out of here then. If we don't move quickly, they'll lock down the port. Yes, yes, that's all of them. Now let's see. If I toss Tanamo into a cabin and set sail today, I should just make Velen ahead of the news. Good luck, dry legs. <laughs>